Welcome back, boys and girls. I would like to solve one more story problem using tens and ones with you today. Before we do that, let's review our teen numbers. I am also including 11, 12, and 20. Remember, I'm going to look at this 12 for a minute. When you're referring to teen numbers, you always put the one in the tens place and then your ones in the ones place. Make sure you don't reverse it and end up writing 21. So let's just review the, the number and word form on my flashcards. Of course, continue to practice with your flashcards. I've seen a couple of flashcard sets uh, come across Dojo. They're awesome. Keep up the good work. All right, so 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. High five. Now, let's look at our story problem for today. It says, my friend has 10 red balloons and six green balloons. What is the sum of her balloons? So it is asking what the sum of her balloons are. That happens to be a gust the plus word. If you see sum, it is telling you that you need to add sum. We need to add these two numbers, 10 and 6. All right, and if you notice, I've already put my little friend up here. She has 10 red balloons, so I'm going to draw 10. I'm going to give her 10 red balloons. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten red balloons, and six green balloons. Here is my green. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. So she has six green balloons, 10 red balloons. We can count them all together. That is one way we can solve it. But today I thought we should look at our 10 frames again. 10 green balloons, six, I'm sorry, 10 red balloons and six green balloons. One, two, three, four, five, six. You may be able to look at this and say, oh, Miss Wilkerson, that's six. It has six dots and four spaces. If you have been working with your 10 frames. So 10 and six, let's count them together. First, we'll count our balloons together. Then we'll count our 10 frames together and see if they match. They should match. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen balloons. Now look at the ten frames. Let me move it over so you guys can see it. There we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, 15, 16. I'm still getting 16, so I am pretty confident that 16 is my answer. I'll circle my answer. Um, you could count it like this. Count on from the 10. 10, 11, 
12, 13, 14, 15, 16. That's another way I could solve it fairly quickly to get the same answer, 16. Or we've been working with tens and ones using the base 10 blocks. So I could draw my 10 stick if I wanted to represent 16 by drawing my 10 stick and then six bits. One, two, three, four, five, six, 10 and six, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. So, so no, matter, no matter what way I try to solve this problem, I should come up with 16 as my answer. So I can now write my sentence. Now, this is new. We haven't done this a lot. However, when we do the math challenge um, to win that free t-shirt, to get all your points, you have to write a, an actual sentence saying she has 16 balloons. She has 16 balloons and if you do all of this work on those math challenge problems you should definitely get full credit I mean we put a lot of work into this one problem so keep putting your work into it um, show your work show how you got the answer and rock it out so that you can get your free there those free cool tie-dye orange and navy blue t-shirts i think that would be awesome and we have had a couple of people already do the challenge for this week so if you haven't done it yet two more days today and tomorrow and then we score them all for this week and we'll start again with a new problem next week um, also, keep working on those teen numbers. Remember, 12 is 2 and 10. 13 is 3 and 10. 14, 4 and 10, and so on. That will help you um, with the teen numbers as well. With that, there's the base 10 blocks. Everything we've learned. And we will be really good when it comes to working with teen numbers. High five. And I will see you guys again later. Goodbye.